Okay, this is an IC chip reader. Uh, it's hap happened to call, be called IC tester. If you start using these, which is uh, inter integrated um, chips, uh, then sometimes you need to know if it's working or not. And how do you make that uh, sure? Is you push this button in here, it turns it on, it says self check pass, which is good. Now we're going to close the zip socket and then push the enter one more time. And it tells me that this is an NE555. And that's how you do it. Uh, if you want to test a different one, you pull this one out. And uh, now I can't remember which of these, uh, where did I actually get it from? It's one of these. And I'm going to grab a different chip. They have this little tiny notch, which is represented by that. So that goes to the top. That's pin number one on the left upper side. And then you push this button, and this one says LM393. And uh, when you can turn it off, you're done. Just uh, put it back in a compartment. And uh, Now I know that all these chips uh, that I put in work. And that's how simple it is. Just a 9-volt battery goes down here. On the bottom. Um, otherwise than that, there's not much more to it than one of these. They are about 80 bucks or so without the adapters. I bought it with 